on the ice, representing France, Sophie Moniot, Pascal Lavanchy. And Sophie and Pascal are lying in fifth place after the compulsory dances. They were fifth in Europe and fifth in the world last year. Moniot, Pascal Lavanchy of France. Smooth, original dance. They made the rumba music. Sound like rumba and look like rumba. And their steps and all that went through it was uh, very good. It's, it's going to be interesting to see how it compares with our friends from Russia. Well, it was a very ballroom interpretation, which the ISU have been telling us that's what they want to uh, bring ice dancing back to, although that view has not been entirely backed by the judges. She was awfully close to them then. Skate almost on the edge of the boards. Good record recently, these two. They uh, won Skate America, they won Skate Canada. But in two consecutive uh, major championships in Europe, they've had problems in the free dance. A lot of our movement. They're allowed only two separations. That's a photograph uh, mother and father might like to keep. So, the first mark is for composition, and there's pretty general agreement here. Five fives beating the five fours. Five five, five five, five four, five five, five four, five five. Pretty consistent marking. There hasn't been movement among the skaters below them. The Canadians lead at this stage, but I think they're about to be surpassed. Five, seven, three of those for presentation. And they are obviously delighted with their marks. Their coach, Daniel Marotel. And they move into the lead. All the judges like their rumba best. And over the compulsors and the rumba, they lead. <laughs> 